all right, you know, more consistent, be more consistent, but make sure you turn on post notifications. I want to make sure I said that in the beginning so you guys do that. That will help me out, and I would appreciate it if you do it. So thank you. All right, I'm back with another video. Try to make sure I'm more consistent because you guys will literally unsubscribe to me every single time <laughs> if I'm not making a video. So I'm making a video on my progression. One thing that I have to worry about with my hair, like I'm noticing, is my I'm trying to I'm left-handed, so I'm trying to get better brush on my right hand. That's like one of the biggest things I've noticed that I'm having issues with is that my right hand is not dominant. So I feel like if you are right-handed you may have problems with your left hand i'm having issues with that but my hair is growing and my hair grows really really fast like when you use the products that i'm talking about my your hair is gonna grow a lot faster so i have to keep up with brushing like if i don't keep up with brushing on my hair i will get like a lot of forks and it's just not gonna be good um i'm going back i think i said before i'm going back to an all over pattern um, like a more even pattern so if you guys want to stick around i'll say stick around because i'm gonna do the whole 360 thing again and i'm gonna try to make sure my i use better brushes because i've noticed ever since i've used the brush i'm using in the video my waves have gotten like a lot better and a lot more even too so um you know that diane brush is really good but as you can see my hair is really really healthy i was probably because i'm using that oil that oil and that can too is it just works wonders and then i'm also using like uh wave grease so i um i'm doing that but it's going it's going well man like i'm really enjoying the progress i'm trying to keep you guys more updated because you guys want more wave content from me and only wave content so i'm trying to get better on that uh another thing is i'm going to do a a swirl i think i'm gonna do a swirl type of crown i think a swirl will be better to me than a beehive thing i don't know it's just like the beehive thing just doesn't work on me like just trying to make sure it's like all circular and stuff i don't know i think a, i might try a swirl i've never tried a swirl like trying to recreate a swirl so i'm gonna try to do that another thing that's been helping me out is combing my uh my hair like combing has been really really good for me personally but uh yeah just trying to make sure i uh like comb out like any forks or whatever i feel like that's that helps me too so if you have like hair like mine or your hair looks similar combing helps you but you cannot get away from brushing you have to brush a lot like i'm telling you you have to if you do not brush you're going to come into like a lot of problems so make sure you keep brushing and brush a lot man i'm telling you but yeah, this is like pretty much a quick little update. I haven't got my hair cut. Just real quick, focus, not focusing on nothing. Like just making sure my pattern, that's the only thing I'm worried about is making sure I'm getting my right side. My right side is my weak side. So that's the only thing I'm kind of worrying about right now. My hair is growing longer, as I said before. So, I mean, I'm not focusing on anything else but my pattern, man. Like that's it. So it's a lot of work, but I feel like it's going to be worth it, especially when I get my full pattern in the back and then when i work on my crown so yeah i think that's gonna be a good thing i'm just trying to make sure it looks great